Hi everybody, it's Caroline Shelley from HF Planners and welcome back to our weekly video series on the future of the office space. This week we're talking about returning to the office and what has to happen to your HVAC system in order to prepare the space for returning workers. I'm sure your offices have been closed for two, maybe three months now, and the air has become stagnant. What has to happen, according to the CDC, is that the air exchange has to be increased since they have discovered and the research has proven that COVID-19 hangs in the air. So by increasing the airflow throughout your building, you will help provide a more comfortable and less sick environment. So things that have to happen uh, includes increasing your ventilation, changing the air filters uh, within, within the building prior to occupancy, clean the ducts that have been sitting dormant for a couple of weeks now, and keep the systems running longer if possible, 24 by seven, in order to keep the air exchange flowing. You may also want to consider having a fixed number of seats within certain occupants in the HVAC zone in order to keep the transmission down. Prioritize your air intake versus recycled air wherever possible. And there are many more opportunities to clean your air in these spaces, including ionizing air filtration units. So we're here to help. There's a lot to know about these days, and we certainly want to make sure that people are comfortable returning to their office space. I hope all is well with you, and I look forward to hearing from you soon. Take care.